Alright, hello and welcome back to Let's Play Final Emblem Fates Conquest with Eatonclock55. The last time we had support conversations and uh, other stuff in the base, I believe. I'm not sure if we actually finished the last chapter in that part as well, I don't think so. Maybe we did. <laughs> I don't remember. It's been a while. Um, and yeah, we started this chapter as well. Which is the paralogue of Mozu, a villager who I can't chill right now because <laughs> I'm in the midst of a battle which I paused. Okay, so let's see how this goes. Maybe I'll even miss so I won't kill them all. Nope. Guess I did it right. Guess I'll kill them all. That's a lot of damage. That was closer than it should have been. <laughs> well, now this one's gonna kill me. Great. How could this happen? What a great start to an episode! <laughs> I did not consider that. I thought I was more tanky than that, but no, of course not. <laughs> I'm not tanky in this file. Not yet, at least. <laughs> Alright. So I guess I'll have to cut here. See in a second. <laughs> when I'm about at the same spot. Maybe with less... Well, with, with no mistakes. <laughs> Alright, see you in a second. Alright, we're probably not a, quite... Uh, not a little... Well, we are probably a little bit less far in, but... Yeah. <laughs> enemy face. Let's weaken up this enemy a, a bit. Then... Have Mozu finish uh, that one off. And these two, well, nothing to worry about, with Effie as a sh as a shield up front. There we go. Strength and resistance. Now let's see. Can you maybe Jacob? Can you weaken him? One damage. So lowering his defense by two points, I believe. No, three points is enough. As long as Jacob doesn't crit now. Right. Um, she could just pick up the kill. She could. She could have also just picked up the kill on this one. <laughs> what a shame. Actually, she can still do that. She won't die from one hit. Now, let's go. That one should be able to reach her, right? Yeah. Good. Now, um... Let's put Elise out of the range of danger by simply putting Effie as a shield. Um, yeah, putting Effie there as a shield. Now let's see. Only this one can reach, right? These spots, yeah. Um, let's put um, Silas here. And who am I gonna put there? Probably him. Let's just... nope. Have him stand there. Perfect. Just oh, run into your death. <laughs> there we go. Almost a level up for Mozu. Great, now the next one's moving over. That one can actually reach me. How would that go? 11. Yeah, um... 
Right. Attacking this one from afar. How would that go? 10 damage, so it's too much. With the knife, 8. So I guess it'll be Jacob to weaken the enemy then, again. Now... Mm, yeah, let's position... Let's have Arthur fight that one. Um, 100% hit chance. Yeah. Let's finish this one off with her. And a level up for Mozu, let's see. <laughs> Thanks to aptitude. Her stat increases are higher. Not as extreme as an awakening, but still. Um, yeah, that's susceptible, I guess. <laughs> I mean, for someone as weak as Mozu, at the beginning I would have loved for her to also get a strength growth, but that's fine. Um, let's see here. You're not level 10 yet, you can't use your level 10 ability, of course. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I can't heal her up. Not right now, at least. No. A level up for Arthur. Ah, well, HP and defense. <laughs> Not a good one. <laughs> um, two damage. Are we gonna repeat this? Could you just... Thank you very much. Here we go. You can put back your back back on your weapon. Um, from here because forest woods. Um, one hundred percent hit chance with Jacob, so that's fine. Be careful. Even if she were to miss. What do you know? Great. Now let's get this one lured in. This time, no. Let's use the Arthur again. Position here. Heal up Arthur. Felice. To give her even more experience too. Training Mozu. <laughs> Basically what this is all about. The perfect chapter to give her a few level ups is her own, so... I'm just using that opportunity. As it seems. As long as no one else helps Jacob out, Arthur and Jacob can weaken an enemy down to 1 HP with negative defense. That's uh. <laughs> that suddenly isn't a problem. 100% hit chance of Jacob on, at the side as well. Yep, you gotta level up, Mozu. <laughs> okay, let's see. This time, no strength again, okay. So I know which weapon I'm gonna equip to her. Well, which weapon I'm gonna give to, give to her soon. As soon as she he reaches a higher weapon level, th that is. Um, now let's see. Can't reach any spaces. Or enemies. These to share these spaces though. Can could lure one with those down there. Hmm. Would you grant additional movement? Would you grant No, neither of you would probably do that. Let's see. Yeah. Then let's just move back down here. 
and lure in the lower one already. Well, next turn. Won't be possible this turn around, but that's fine. Let's see here. Mm. Well, he can move much closer, so I guess I'll just have to leave it at that. My face. Um, here. You can also get some EXP from healing, so do, just go do that. Um, so the luring part. Stuff. Heal. Arthur. Um, okay. Let's leave it at that. Oh, I did not equip him a weapon again. Whoops. <laughs> but they attack missed, okay. This is fine. Now let's see. Um can even reach him yet. Then let's do it like this. How much damage would that be? Two. Her defense would increase by two points. That would be fine. So let's unequip the weapon with Silas, Silas for now. And do the weakening thing again. There we go. You can equip your weapon again too. Switch and take care of this one. Even if it's not 100% a chance. Ah. Don't like that. But one hit is only 5 damage. So that's fine. Um. Let's move them here and end this turn. Please accept my help. Hmm. The other one will now proceed to kill himself. We can do this together. Or itself. Whatever it that thing its gender would be. Let's see here. Three damage. Um, that would work. Effie, could you? Thank you. I can do this. You are excused. That was not what you were supposed to do, Jacob. No surprise there. <laughs> well, fine. I guess. Can all, can all, not all, yeah, you can't all, not, ah, whatever. You can't not, wait, you can't, you can't always count on not critting, that's what I meant to say. Was that so hard? No, not really. Um, let's see. Separate. Silas, over there. This is fine. Now let's see how this goes. 11 damage to him, so if Silas were to attack once more from close up, he would be down at 1 HP and Mozu could pick up the kill. That sounds doable. And it's weapon level for Silas. So, that's great. Um, right now Mozu. One damage, right. Finish him off. <laughs> Good job hitting. Otherwise I would have needed to use Elise to heal her up and then put someone on the other side of Elise to protect Mozu. Still no strength growth, I don't like this. Alright then, 
let's see. Um, you could see some more healing, but I'd rather let Elise do that, because she needs those experience points. Because she can't fight. Now let's see. Heal up. And let's move closer. We're gonna give all this, th those EXP to Mozu as well, as long as it's possible. But with someone with an high accuracy as high as Jacob on my side, nothing should be the problem. Um, yeah, there shouldn't be a problem is what I meant with that. <laughs> okay. Did I mark... No, I did not mark him. Position here. Air up. Separate again. Now, let's see. She could use the XP right now. Okay, she's got the weapon equipped. That's fine. Now, let's wait here. I won't let you down. 16. That if Arthur hits 2, 22. Perfect. Down to 1 HP. Perfect for Mosa to pick up. Um. 100% with Jacob, also 100%, that's perfectly fine. Some strength growth would be nice now though. Um, separate. Let's put him here. Me too. Okay. Instead of luring this guy over, gonna be luring this guy in, meaning Effie will need to just stand here. Um, let's, oops, separate you here, position Jacob there as well, here we go. Like the job was, yeah, the objective was to rout the enemy, so that's fine. Two damage from the boss. I can live with that. Now let's see. Is there someone who can deal little damage with a ranged attack? Probably not. Not little enough at the very least. That would be one damage. I guess I could do it like this. That will work. Separate. And let's move Elise back there too. Let's see, 12 defense. Okay, this is fine. She'll be able to finish this one off by herself. Well, it'll need one more turn after this, but she won't be able to die from just that, so that's fine. I can do this. As long as the enemy doesn't retreat, which I doubt a faceless would do. Um, she should be able to finish him off right away. Now let's see. Yep. Now then, goodbye. Wow, look at me. <laughs> Another level up for Mozu. Still no strength. That's weird, okay. <laughs> I didn't remember her strength growth to be that rare. And HP earned also. It's also a stat that's not growing well, apparently. Okay, let's heal up Mozu. 
the next attack against her will be blocked. Or against Effie. I might... Maybe I should just make use out of this. Switch over. And attack with the Hand Axe. First attack lands a hit. Let's wait here. Would you mind? Maybe I should just. I won't be able to attack either, so. Jacob, we're gonna hurt this one a little bit. Um. Let's see. If you were to hit again, we have no choice. good. Okay, your damage would be zero. What's your strength against this defense? Defense of fourteen. So, okay. Well, the flame sure can lowest the, that by the most. So. Minus four, it should uh, is what it should be. So she should be able to deal two damage, which is not enough, sadly. However, he can one hit her either. So I can just attack. Or wait, just a second. What's her accuracy? Not that great. What's her accuracy here? Well then, let's just do it like that. The additional damage that Elise grants is <laughs> exactly enough for I can do this. Mosey to be able to finish this one off. <laughs> and huge amount of XP goes to her. <laughs> Let's see. Let me just have him transfer him out. Separate. Elise here. Arthur there. With Arthur's axe. Then may be able to get Moses some more kills. Just like that. There we go. And a hit. Together with that one attack of Jacob again. Wait. Okay. The region is the area is safe. A damage with the food knife. Just don't crit. Good job, Jacob. If you repeat this once more, you'll also have your level up. 100%. Easy. No problem. You have my support. I did it. Good job, Mozu. Ah, there's the strength growth. Finally. <laughs> now then. Let's heal up Effie. And let's position Arthur in the range. Now as long as Arthur still hits. Great. The only requirement now is no crit. <laughs> Good. A level up for Jacob and another level up for Moser will be in this chapter. Um... Oh well, whatever. At least defense screw a little bit. Um... Heal up Arthur, or more experience, or the most experience gained in this chapter. And another level for Elise as well, that's great. <laughs> Step back world, this girl is on fire! <laughs> yep, good job Elise. Right. That'll, that'll take care of this. 
this enemy is done. Now let's see. Um, yeah, Jacob and Mazu. All right. All right. We finished off the last of the. the we finished off the last of the faceless. Um. um, but what do I do now? They took my mother, my life. Huh? You must have some family near here. We'll be glad to take you there. Uh. There's no one. I couldn't even start over here all by myself. All these homes, fields, it's all destroyed. I wouldn't want to stay here even if it was. Wait. I wouldn't, wa I wouldn't want to stay here even if it wasn't. Everyone I called family is dead. Every house a grave. Listen. Listen. We've t we'll take you in. We can't replace all the all those you've lost, but we'll take care of you. Huh? Can I join your group? Yeah. Yeah, but only until we find we find you a safe place you to call home. Our group, our group, a family of sorts, is spawned by a dangerous cause. We go to one. F Wait. We go from one battle to the next, ever in peril. There's... that's no life for you. I'm not afraid. I can help. I might even save you once... save you or your friends. Let me join your cause, whatever it is. I'll keep your family alive. Yes. Yes, of course. I have to admit, you so you just... wait. You sound just like one of us already. I'll do my best. I'll do my best. And I'll stay safe. After all, mother's watching over me now. Whew. That was well. Um, the first attempt, in the very least, was harder than was supposed to be. And huh, I guess this game goes after real time. Huh, that's too bad. I set back my um my clock of the 3DS back a few hours in order to still make it today <laughs> since it's uh, 20 minutes past midnight um, yeah the day before this one that it's now would have been Tour's birthday <laughs> which is the birthday of a friend of mine that's why I chose that date <laughs> well Seems like you can't uh, trick your 3DS, I guess. It'll probably count from the day you've uh, you've had your 3DS set to at that point of time. Um, when you first created the file, and then it'll count on its own. Too bad, too bad. Alright. Well then, support conversations. I guess I could just do these as well. But not uh, before I equip aptitude. <laughs> yeah, that's how I'm gonna play through this run with all the skills I can grab. Speaking of skills I can grab, I'll probably grab some for Jacob as well, since uh, Jacob is actually the butler class is a promoted unit out of the troubadour class. And the skill he learned, um, Lift to Serve, is actually the level 5 skill of the Butler class, meaning level t after, level, after reaching level 20, the Troubadour class, and then class changing, it's still level 5, so in other words, level 25. Meaning he can already learn all the th level 25 skills he that he can grab, so I will probably give him one of them. Um, at least one. Probably more. I won't hold back in that regard, in the very least. And, yeah. Let's do the support conversations. Uh, every, everyone, uh, every single one except for Jacob and Mozu. Because this is uh, the first pairing out of my parties, uh, party members that I will have. I don't think any of the others were paired up with, are paired up with one another. Let's see, just a second. Um, nope. None of the others are paired up with one another. 
So, yeah. Arthur and Elise. I am coming, Milady Elise. Your loyal Arthur rides to rescue. Rides to the rescue. Stay your fe Stay your fearful heart. <sighs> A thousand apologies, Milady. I did not mean to keep you waiting. To think if you had been a wait accosted by thugs, and it took me so long to reach you. Oh no! Don't worry, Arthur. It's nothing like that. I just had a question I wanted to ask. Uh, well, I am a man of little learning, but I can help. Please ask away. Wait, but if I can help, please ask away. So you're a man of justice, right, Arthur? So I was wondering, is there anything you would you wouldn't do to help someone in trouble? No, I would not. I would. I wouldn't. Wait. I would stop at nothing to save even a single person from harm, milady. I am a milk lady's law. If a milk lady, I thought um, he was gonna say something else with um. I don't actually know. <laughs> um, if a milk lady lost a child, I'd score. Uh, I'd score the entire globe for that little babe. If an old man could no longer walk, I myself would serve as his legs as long as need be. Wow, so cool! If someone zobbed a single zob, I would tickle them until they smiled. If I saw a fight, I would break it up, but not before I brought their hands together. <laughs> this time this time in the wait. This time in the loving clasp of friendship rather than a deadly grapple of war. Uh, I suppose I needn't go on. You get the idea. I am who I've always been, destroyer of evil, champion of the weak. I am Arthur, the hero of justice. Wow, you sound so gallant. Is there anything you can't do? Not a thing in the world, milady. Jeez, Arthur, you're amazing. You're not just a hero, you're you're like an... an... ultra hero! Oh ho, you flatter me too much, my liege. Now, why did you ask me all this? Is there something you... Uh, is there something that ails you? If anything troubles you, I vow right now to vanquish it for you, right in its evil face. Really? Well, Arthur, actually I... I, um... never mind. What? Lady Elise, I beg of you, if there's anything at all, you must tell me. I have sworn to aid you in all things, you know this. <laughs> yeah, I know. Sorry. Pretend you didn't hear anything. They, there are just some things even an ultra hero of justice stuff can't do. So, uh, um, see ya. By my le- <laughs> By my leather loin protector, that girl can be a mystery sometimes. <laughs> Effie and Jacob. That's... Oh, I, I do know that support. Effie, I beg your pardon, but what are you eating? Mm, just some cake. I knew it. You do realize I baked that cake, especially for Lady Tuor. You did? Wait, you did? Then you shouldn't leave it out like this. Someone could eat it by mistake. Would you please put the rest of the cake down? I don't think you realize just how good... <laughs> I don't think you realize how good this tastes after a long workout. If you can't rein yourself in, I will have to stop you by force. Very well then. Yeah. Huh? My attack had no effect on you at all. Um, at all. Uh, my voice cracked at the end of that, so... You have to try harder than that. Even then, I doubt you can stop me. Curse you, Effie. Now what am I going to serve at tea time? If I were you, I'd make some more of that cake. It was delicious. <laughs> I... think I had had her voice better already before. Um, Tour and Silas. Silas. Hello, Silas. Do you have a moment... Do I have a moment of time is what I wanted to say? <laughs> Do you have some time? Huh? Oh, hi there, Tuor. Need something? Sort of. You mentioned that we were childhood friends, but... I'm trying to figure out how you remembered that when I didn't. Oh, is that all? I wouldn't worry about it. Those old memories slip away from everyone. for everyone. But isn't it strange that I'd forget someone so close to me? 
You became a castle knight just, to, just so our paths would cross again. Well, I, on the other hand, forgot you existed at all. Really, though, I wish you wouldn't worry about it. You remember now, and that's all that matters to me. My, my hard work's paid off, didn't it? I became a castle knight, and here we are. I'm grateful for the chance to make up for the lost time. Grateful, huh? That's a good way of looking at it. Thanks, Silas. <laughs> Thanks, Silas. <laughs> um. There's the cheer, remember? Oh, hey, why don't we go? Why don't we go take a little trip together sometime? Hmm? It sounds fun, but where should we go? Some place you've always wanted to see. When we were young, he had a long list of places he wished you could go. We couldn't go to any of them at the time, but nothing stop nothing's stopping us now. Not a war, no. Um. <laughs> it sounds nice, but I don't think you should go far, given the circumstances. Hmm, <laughs> you're right. But I would, but don't worry, I'll find a way to make it work. Do you have something up your sleeve? <laughs> Sorry if I made my plans seem great, uh, grander than they are. If we can't go far, we limit our options to places within reach. You might not remember all the places on your old list, but I do. Great! Thank you for doing this, Silas. I, Silas. Hey, what are friends for? Now get go. Now get pa Now go get. Pa wait. Now go get packed for the trip. I will. Silas is a really good guy. So how did I forget about him? He told me not to worry about it, but there's got to be a reason. All right, we'll do the other support next time because this part is already long enough again. All right, this is it for this time. Hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, then, when we'll continue with the main story and have some supports between Jacob and Mozu. Basically, more than enough supports between those two. Anyways, this is it for this time. Hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, then, bye.